everyone and happy Saturday so I'm gonna try and vlog um, a Saturday um, a Saturday in quarantine I've got quite a few ideas I want to do today a few things I want to do in the house so I feel like it's gonna be um, it's gonna be fun so yeah this is me in the morning I don't do this every day but today I woke up and I was like oh look the Sun is peeping through my room let me enjoy that and plus I woke up quite early as well so I thought it wouldn't be a bad idea to start my day quite early so so yeah if it is your first time on my channel hello welcome thank you for joining the family um, be sure to like subscribe as well as press the notification bell and if it isn't your first time hello how are you doing hope you're having a wonderful Saturday yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and start my Bible studies I've just finished my Bible study and I just wanted to share the app that I use, what I use for my Bible studies as well as my Bible. I also have the Bible app on my phone um, and I really like this app because it just sort of like has quite a lot on it that can help you um, read the word and meditate on the word and understand things better. Um, so yeah. Check me out, check me out. Boom, bam, bam, bop. Bada bop, boom. Pow. Oh! going to town for like two things I feel like I'm dressed to the most in it like so I've just got this top I've got some black jeans I'm gonna put on my black leather jacket <laughs> should I tie it up or should I just From here that should be fine so I got some yellow pink and sort of like peach um, tulips that they were a pound each and I think there's about what one is missing but hey there's one two three four five six on each there's five on this one because I didn't realize one was missing, but yeah, so I got that. I got these little placemats, which are really cute. They're just like floral yellow placemats. And then I got these feathers, which I have a good idea what I'm going to do with these. I got this Malteser, which I'm hoping is what I think it is. Oh, perfect. Fantastic. It's a golden egg. Cool. 
so. Oh, and he comes in like a little basket. How cute is that? Um, yeah, cool. Um, I got this table runner, which is like a grass table runner. This was just, that's the illusion it's supposed to give. I got some napkins, uh, paper napkins that have like some details on it. Oh my gosh, I got these cute little bunnies. These cute little bunnies, I got them. And then I got these little chicks, these little ones. And this was the cutest, these little eggs, like unicorn eggs. They were so cute, so I got those. I got some flower lights, white ones and yellow ones. Some egg decorations, golden egg chocolate. Yeah. I got some Smarties, M and M eggs. Well, I just got these because I wanted to get that. And some snacks as well. I also looked around my house and picked a few things that I already had um, that would be perfect to add to the table. Um, so yeah, those are just a few things. I will be decorating my dining table and here I'm starting off with the table runner. So with this table runner, I basically wanted to have the illusion of um, outdoor grass um, egg hunt feel. So I got this table runner and it was actually the perfect the perfect length and I'm just adding some blue tack at the bottom because I wanted it to be super flat on the table um, obviously because it was rolled up it sort of like didn't really have much flat structure so I was just like helping it um, but yeah so this is what I'm doing right now um, the idea that I had was basically to recreate like an outdoor egg hunt um, table setting basically um, and yeah and the way I'm going about this is obviously I've bought everything I've like found things in my house but like the ideas in my head were really just going with the flow and deciding what to do next where to go next and yeah so just being creative and that's what I love about it so obviously now I'm putting the two plate uh, the place mats that I found and again I had to fix the, uh, the table runner because like I said it was rolled up but um yeah so as I'm fixing that I added the two placemats at each end of the table runner because I just wanted to put them there. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I was going to put a place on the table, then I decided to move my table a little bit further away from the wall because I wanted to change the setting a little bit instead of having chairs at each end of the, at each side of the table. I wanted to have them sort of like. Um, two on each side and this is what I'm doing here well obviously I had to move things around um, yeah so I'm just moving chairs around to make it make sense really um, but yeah fix your trousers girl fix your trousers but um, yeah so this is what I'm doing right now just moving things about um, and then obviously I would have to fix the camera because I really wanted to record this um, this setup and again I feel like this setup could work for like obviously Easter lunch if you have kids or if you just want to decorate your table whatever uh, but I also feel like it would really work for a baby shower or a birthday party for kids especially um, so if you really like the Easter um, egg hunt sort of feel if your birthday is around this time of the year I feel like this would be a perfect way to decorate for your kids um, if your kids birthdays I meant it would be a perfect way to decorate for your kids or if you're expecting I mean a baby boy or even a baby girl actually I think it would be a cute little um, baby shower theme 
So right now, obviously on the other side, because I couldn't keep turning the camera back and forth, on the other side, like I showed before, I have my coffee table with other items. And one thing I love about planning is that when you plan, you tend to find things that you can reuse. Like the little baskets that I'm using right now, I'll be bringing uh, to the table right now, are from a baby shower that I planned for a friend of mine um, a couple months ago. I kept them because I just really liked, they look like little baskets and they, they were like perfect for snacks and I used them um, when I cut up like fruits and stuff. So I just felt like it would be, they would be perfect for the, um, the idea that I was going for. So obviously right now I'm trying to put the bouquet together um, but yeah, so keeping things from other events is very important because they will always come in handy. Um, but yeah, so right now I'm just sort of like putting a form at the bottom so that the flowers can stand properly again form that I used previously. Um, but yeah, so just having fun with it and I guess obviously if you don't really have much of an idea of what you're doing um, then I guess it's gonna take you a little bit longer but I feel like it's important to just enjoy the enjoy the time so I was trying to add some white roses um, to just fill up the the flower pot but then I was like nope that's not working <laughs> so I took them away but that's the whole point and I changed them for yellow roses instead because I felt like yellow was um, like made more sense with the theme and I mean honestly yellow is such a beautiful color anyways um white roses would have worked for another for another theme not this one I don't think um this is such a summery spring colorful look and I don't really think white roses were doing it for me so yeah here I am just putting it together mixing them up um you know filling in the gaps and just making sure it looks good but yeah, so that's the idea really, just having fun with it and just like being creative. So right, plates on the table, glasses on the table, decorations on the table, the bowls have feathers inside. I also brought out some mason jars, brought out some candles. Um, so yeah, this is like the main sort of like look but there's still a few bits missing because this table doesn't look complete so here is the final reveal of the table so right now i'm just taking videos of little details that that little bunny is so cute um but yeah guys i absolutely love the table the turn now added some candles added some bowls in the mason jars some chocolate um some chocolate snacks um i used um cupcake holders to put them in because I didn't want them to be in the in the feathers um, but yeah I turned on the candles I also absolutely adore this little um, unicorn eggs they're just so cute honestly um, but yeah so I'm taking some pictures as well as um, recording so I added some purple ribbons to the mason jars um, that I just found really cute. This candle in the yellow cup I made in my previous video and also the illusion of the golden cup, um, the golden egg I mean, <laughs> not the golden cup, but the golden egg. Once again, another unicorn. Um, I brought out my light board and had a little message on it and brought a little uh, board with um, labels, bought some drinks. Um, but yeah, really like it just turned out so pretty. It could be for a baby shower, a birthday party, Easter brunch, whatever you want it to be. Um, if you liked this video, please, 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 please thumbs up and leave me a comment in the comment section below. Um, so obviously I am trying to vlog my weekend and today is Sunday which normally at this time I would be at church but due to the current uh, situation and the lockdown and everything we cannot be at church so I am actually currently streaming um, watching the live stream of my 
of the sermon um, on my laptop. So yeah, um, basically woke up this morning, got ready, dolled up and everything. And yeah, so that's how my morning has been. I haven't really done much um, apart from just catching up and talking. Um, sending messages and all that so that's what I'll be doing today I'm, I'm planning to cook later um, and just like have a nice meal really um, but yeah so that's really all I'm gonna be doing I'm not really doing much again because I am stuck at home I didn't really finish I don't think I finished yesterday's vlog but we'll see how everything comes together because again I am really trying to put a vlog together in my home <laughs> without really breaking the rules and whatnot so yeah Hey guys, so for the rest of Easter Sunday, I didn't really do much. Um, I had both the services of my church online, obviously, and then I cooked a roast dinner, which I didn't record, but hey ho. Um, yeah, I really tried to put a vlog together, but then it was a little bit difficult because again, on Sunday, I didn't do anything apart from just being home and watching TV and just, yeah, quarantining at home. But here I am again showing you guys my table that I absolutely, absolutely love. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching this messy vlog. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you like it. Be sure to like, comment and subscribe. Um, don't forget to share and I'll see you in my next video.